Hello everyone, let's find our way with TMS FNC Maps. And to do that, we will create a simple application to show you how easy it is to use our control. TMS FNC Maps is some kind of successor to our WebG Maps and WebOS Maps products that are available for VCL and FMX. But as this is an FNC product, it means that next to VCL and FMX, you can now use it on TMS WebCore and Lazarus. This way, you can deploy to Microsoft, Android, Mac and iOS, Linux, and web applications. So TMS FNC Maps, cross framework, cross platform, and also cross service. This means that with the same control, you can use it for Google Maps, OpenStreetMaps, Gear Maps, Microsoft Azure and Bing Maps, TomTom, Tom, and Mapbox. So you can deploy to almost any device that you want with the service that you prefer. And as this is in one control, you just need to learn that one and not for every service another component. Another huge advantage is that if some service may raise its fees or if it's down for the moment, you can just change it in runtime. TMS FNC Maps was released in April and there is already a major release uh, with some great new features and Bart and Peter are already working on version 1.2. Now let me show you how easy it is to use. We will retrieve the coordinates from location. In this example, I've used Brussels, the capital of Belgium. We'll add a marker to that place and show a pop-up if you click on a marker. When we place the FNC Maps control on our form, you'll notice that this uses the TTMS FNC web browser. So make sure that your DLLs are in the correct folder. This is the systems folder and that you are using an up-to-date Edge Chromium. Here you can set the different properties as the API key for your service, add markers, polygons, polylines, rectangles, and you can set the service. It's initialized on Google Maps, so for that you'll need an API key. But if you change it to open layers, as this doesn't use an API key, you can immediately see the map. Now, if we want to retrieve the location of Brussels, we use the TTMS FNC geocoding component. So we'll create it and set an API key because this uh, uses uh, Google Maps here. And um, then we do get geocoding, um, the location that we want, the address that we want, in this case, Brussels. And here we use a anonymous callback. You can also use the on get geocoding event um, to add the marker. So in this, we'll check if we have more than one uh, item because you can have multiple hits on some location. And then we use the add marker method where we set the coordinate that we've retrieved as the uh, coordinate and the city as the title for the marker. We also do the set center coordinate. This is just so we don't have to pan through the whole map uh, to find our Brussels marker. Another thing that we've added is on the on marker click. On marker click. We do a show pop up uh, if you click on the marker. This is with the same coordinates as we have from the marker with the title that we've put into the marker. And I've just added some extra HTML text. So I set the uh, title to bold, then added capital of Belgium and an image that I've just chosen from Wikipedia of, of the Atomium. And this is how easy it is to switch services with the, the service property. You just set it to Google Maps. That's all. So if we now run this application, so this is a program that is running. In the meantime, I've added the API key for Google Maps. Um, but here you can see or map for open street maps. Let's say for example that is down and we just change it to Google Maps. And if we click on Brussels, we do the geocoding to retrieve the coordinates of Brussels and center to it immediately. There it is. And if we click on the marker, we'll execute our event to the pop-up. We use Brussels with a picture of the Atomium. Here you can see just the same example, but created in TMS WebCore to show you how easy it is to use our FNC components um, this is just the same code with the same result. Hopefully this opens up the path for you to TMS FNC Maps. 
in case you have any other obstacles on your way, I can advise to you this great book, Hands On with Delphi FNC Maps, from my colleague and friend Dr. Holger Flick, who created a great step by step guide to build a highly advanced TMS FNC Maps application. This is available via Amazon, and I'll leave a link below. Thank you for watching. Till the next time.